Hey, what is up guys? Wicked95 here, back with another video. Welcome to Wicked's Action Figure Reviews. And today, I have another unboxing and review to do for you guys. This time, I have the Ultimate Edition John Cena. Now, arguably, I think this figure um, is going to be one of the top figures of 2021. Um, it's just so sick. Um, I do have a pretty good collection of John Cena's, I have four, I had five, um, I gave one away, but, um, this is gonna be basically my fifth figure, um, that I have in my collection, well, I have another of this John Cena mock, and this one I'm gonna open, uh, to do a review for you guys, possibly add it to my fake fed, I am not 100% sure, and I do have another one up for sale, if you guys want a John Cena, hit me up. My Instagram link will be in the description. I also have a lot more figures for sale. And I'll be doing a figure um, for sale review. I mean a video for you guys. So um, if you're interested in picking up uh, some figures, I have them. Um, yeah, let's get into this. I think this is uh, Ultimate 10. Like I've been mentioning in, me, uh, in my Rock video. If you guys didn't check that out, go check them out link in the description i also did a stone cold and a rick flair so um, i'll probably link those in the description as well since i'm doing them back to back but this john cena is so sick though look at this also the loyalty respect john cena chang gang john cena black and white this is a sick john cena honestly you get three interchangeable heads as well that screaming face says jacks all all over he also has a hat right there, iconic John Cena hat, soft good shirt. I don't know if this shirt is going to be a Velcro shirt from the back or like the Stone Cold one that we got. Hopefully it's like the Stone Cold one. We also get uh, three interchangeable heads, uh, hands with the open mic hands that he has on the figure. The you can't see me hands and of course the uh, word live hands right there. Um, I just wish we could have the brass knucks, but I think the brass knucks were not introduced or he wasn't wearing the brass knucks in this era. That's why. And of course, um, dog, dog tags as well. And he has the WWE spinner championship. WWE spinner. One of my favorite spinner, uh, one of my favorite belts of all time is the spinner. But let's get into this unboxing. You guys picked up this john cena let me know how it is i've been seeing it in, in every target retail i don't know if it, this case in every other state i think it is it, targets are just flooded with cenas um i haven't seen one in walmart i haven't seen a cena or rock in walmart so i don't know if that's uh a target exclusive i'm not sure if walmart didn't get them because i saw the uh flares and stone colds at both stores but i haven't seen a cena or a rock in any walmart that i've been to let me know what you guys um have seen in your stores oh we didn't check the back of this huh here is the john cena figure right there and the same cena here the rock one didn't even have a picture of the same one let me see if i have the rock see the rock he has you have the same figure up there but you don't have the same like gear that he was wearing in that night but this one you do except he's just missing the dog tags here but yeah here we go damn you get a lot in this all right let's start off with the heads like i said this is like a like a jack's head screaming head um, I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can go get my Jax Cena, you guys can see. I have, uh, three John Cenas. I think I have four, actually, Jax John Cena, so. I have the, uh, Green Shorts Deluxe Aggression, Black Shorts De Deluxe Aggression. Here's a Chain Gang. And I also have two, uh... Uh, basics or ruthless aggression here's the hustle loyalty and yes it is a velcro kind of kind of sucks but all right we'll take it here is 
the you can't see me hands that we have gotten before on his figures nothing new and you get the uh chain gang i mean word life <laughs> word life hands that we just got with the new uh mattel um elite WWE spinner. Looks pretty dope. And of course, he has to have these tags on the back. Let me take it off really quick. All right, and we're back. Um, I had to uh, take off the tags in the back, the little things that I hate the um, hold the figures feet. But yeah, let's get into the accessories right here. We have the screaming face John Cena. Uh, smiling John Cena face and a neutral smile John Cena right there plus you get his uh, changing hat nothing on the back mine's a little bit folded from the packaging hustle loyalty and respect t-shirt pretty sick a pair of you can't see me hands I'm not sure how I'm gonna pose this figure. Um, I kind of want to pose him like this, but at the same time, I want to pose him how the picture on the back has him with the um, word "life" hands. Um, yeah, and you also get dog tags that are held together by this band. You can just easily remove it. you go pretty cool and i think for accessories as well these count the um the risk the wrist things I forgot what they're called black and a uh white then he does come with this armband as well that has a changing logo and it's white and black pretty pretty sick you can move this one over here if you want the white and white combo or keep it like this however you want pretty sick i like the fact that he's uh has the boxer showing off on his uh pants uh his shorts right there you also have john cena in red right here limited edition on the other side and the chain gang logo on the knee right there on his sh uh left left uh left foot or left knee and of course classic black john cena shoes pretty pretty sick figure um now let's go over the access whoa his head is pretty loose honestly i'm gonna probably put uh, i might keep him with this one i might have him with that one if i'm doing the depending on how i'm gonna pose him i'm not sure yet here is the articulation now these are pretty good the butterfly joints on these our ultimates are pretty good you get double jointed his arms are pretty big for John Cena which is good because Cena's a big dude now the app crunch is pretty good it's better than the other ultimates honestly um, he does have hand rotation as well you guys know that and waist rotation something that the AEW figures don't have if you try to rotate it they just pop off and you have this uh, thigh rotation as well you have nice um, knee double jointed knees which um, being that John Cena has pants uh, short just kind of like awkward to move I just wish that some old Joe's would have this double jointed knee on the on the shorts as well it would have been better to play with um, mine came with like paint scuff right there on the, on the, on the leg. I don't know if I can take that off with maybe acetone. And you can see kind of the paint sipping down there. Like if they taped it and then once they removed the tape, the tape wasn't settled in right. And then just got some of that paint. Um, you do have rotation on his shoe top of his shoe and uh, you get a foot pivot like all the other ultimates plus a little bit of ankle pivot i think this is going to be too loose if you start playing with it i'm not sure 
but that was the articulation for John Cena. The way that I'm going to pose this guy, I am not sure yet. I got to think, but I brought my other John Cena's out in comparison. This is the new top talents or top picks John Cena with the word life. Um, you can put this shirt on this guy. Looks pretty dope. So we got that. We also have the Elite 76, 72, 74. I forget. John Cena with the Babe Ruth uh, Yankees shirt jersey from the time that he returned at WrestleMania. There is that. And the ultimate one, well, the finding moments. John Cena when he returned to Raw or he got drafted to Raw. And he does have the uh, dog tags and the chain gang. You can move this chain gang over to this one. This this one and this one have the lock. And these two have the dog tags. I like this one. And the hat, I thought it looked similar to this one. I like this hat better, honestly. But I guess the hat looks like that hat. So there's that comparison for you. Um, now, I have my Jax ones, like I said. This is the Jax Deluxe Aggression John Cena. As you can see, he also has the same armband. Except this one has a military camo one with the green shorts and the white uh, shoes. Pretty rare John Cena. Um, and see the the face is kind of almost the same as that John Cena and here's well actually here's a uh, Ruthless Aggression John Cena Pretty basic, you know standard John Cena big ass head for some reason They made that Cena with a huge head. I have two of those actually and here is the uh, Other John Cena that kind of has the same except this one doesn't even have a tongue this one does so I think I like this one better. And he also has dog tags that I took off from my other John Cena that I had. So almost the same gear from my Jack Cena. So I really like this Cena as well. Pretty sick, huh? Black and white. <laughs> so you just put you can't see and me is all the way in the back, so pretty pretty cool. Here's the other John Cena for comparison. And last but not least, I wanted to bring out my elite uh, prototype John Cena that has the same spinner championship and the United States championship. What's funny about it is that the US championship, I have one of these loose I showed you guys last time. It's It actually spins, but this one and that one doesn't even spin. Stupid. They should have made it spin like the Jax ones. So yeah, um, so I'm not going to put them in the post because I'm not really sure how I'm going to post them now. But let me know what you guys think about this John Cena. Um, comment down below anything about this John Cena if you're going to get it. Not, I'm excited to get The Undertaker and Kane. So once I do get it, expect that review and unboxing. So yeah, um, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Go follow my Instagram and I'll see you in the next one.